Hi, my name is Bryce. Welcome back to VHS Play, where we are playing Fatal Frame 2 and recording it all on VHS. Last time, we got into the Rope Temple, and what are we doing back here? Well, uh, right inside the Road Temple was the... Uh, road Temple? Rope Temple was the uh, Shadow Key. Uh, we already had Light Key. And, hey, there's a spooky ghost right here. Um, spoilers, I knew the spooky ghost was here because I was trying to take care of this... Uh, Oh jeez, oh jeez, this is... I really like this encounter. <laughs> so, I was trying to take care of this before uh, recording. Uh, and then it's like, you know what, let's, let's do a sign-in and uh, and get get things in. Uh, and then I realized, oh wait, nope, I left the uh, key on the floor. Uh, so, hey, we're doing this again. And uh, good thing this encounter's here again, because this is a really great encounter design. Um, <laughs> these heckin' cloths, the, the hanging cloths, Oh, they're they're fantastically awful for this. They're so I, I love. Uh, mm. Oh no. Okay, we got the uh, the quote unquote dodge chance, I guess. But yeah, the 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 cloth just getting in the way of like this is a fairly standard ghost at this point. No, no, you cheated. <laughs> okay, uh, <laughs> is really hard to maintain a conversation while being attacked by ghost. There was, there was no fatal frame chance on that. Hey. Stop it. Okay. Cohesive words. Hi, my name's Bryce. Welcome back to VHS Play. We're playing Fatal Frame 2. We have two keys. Uh, that that we found the second one. I didn't really want to run back here, but I didn't want to leave it. So I was going to take care of it off between, like, you know, at the, the start of this recording session before I actually, like, signed on. But then that ghost happened, and then I got in here and realized I forgot to grab the key after loading my save. Um, so, yeah. Gave me a chance to come back and, and re-record. Maya, Mayu, Mayu, you're... When you say things like that... <laughs> please just stop saying things like that. So, anyway. Kerfuffles aside, that design for that encounter of just like, here's to the hallway with some hanging cloths. No big deal, right? But what if there's a ghost? That is... Oh, that is such a great wild card to throw in an encounter. It is... It's so good. I'm I'm so oh, it is some good proper, proper spookins right there. I really just want to know what's in the cell. I knew. I knew. On the table, lit faintly by the paper shade lamp, there's some red stained writing paper. Beneath the table, there's a Japanese girl doll looking this way. <laughs> Something on the floor. Uh, type 90 film. There are a row of Buddha statues here. The key to the cell. No. In the I think I missed him. Dang it. That's a lot of books. There's a row of worn out books with crumbling spines here. This camera angle, this is another one of those like really strong camera angles where they've got this, this lantern right here that's taking up a good chunk of the frame. It's one of those, again, really low camera angles. Like, yeah. how many times am I going to play spooky games and then just ramble about camera angles for way too long anyway like it puts so much focus on that light and that light takes up so much of the frame that it's kind of hard to see everything else in the frame and then you've also got like this the the note um that 
that I already inspected. Like that's that's really front and center. Um, like that's really the only thing that could make this stronger. So if there was actually something on the table that was um, uh, a note. Folklorist 9. As expected, the jailer won't tell me anything, won't even say a word. It's a total reversal of the treatment I got when I came to the village. I guess this was the real reason I was invited to the village. The cell is also used to store documents. I was able to find several important manuscripts. I can continue my research, but I doubt anyone will ever see it. Hellish Abyss. It is unclear how long this hole that connects our world to the underworld has existed. They say that if, if the cover to it is opened, it will cause a terrible disaster. This is the origin of the Gate to Hell folktale, as a taboo word is often represented as, in other texts as star. The suffering of the sacrifice is used to seal the hellish abyss. The mourners. They are the guardians of the hellish abyss, and they are the only ones who can get near it. When the year of the ceremony comes, the mourners sew their eyes shut... Uh, nope. Uh, so they cannot glimpse the hellish abyss. Criminals and anyone that has seen the Hellish Abyss are also forced to become mourners. Afterwards, they live underground, never returning to the surface. What can be so bad that looking at it is forbidden? Folklorist 10 Twin Shrine Maidens Twin Shrine Maidens are sacrificed in the Crimson, crimson Sacrifice Ritual. Boys are sometimes used as well. In this case, they are called Altar Twins. Okay, uh, the people of the region believe that twins were once a single being, which was split into two at birth. The ceremony is based on the belief that when the two bodies are reunited as one, the shrine maiden will gain the power of a deity. The text says the older sister must star star the younger and throw her into the star. The star star part must, uh, must refer to the most horrible part of the ritual, probably some kind of sacrifice. The inside of the tree is hollow. A wooden key is inside. That reads to me like a mistranslation. Um, I'm pretty sure that the kanji for tree and the kanji for book are fairly similar. Um, if, I, if I remember correctly, it's like... Book is tree, but with a line, like one extra line. So I imagine that was supposed to be, um, there's, I'm wondering if I'm going the right way now. Like, should I go back to the temple? Was the temple the, the extra stuff? Anyway, translation stuff. Pretty sure those kanji are similar. I think this was supposed to say the book is hollow. Um, here's the hammer key. Maybe it opens the side door of the house. House map, great. Candlelight illuminates the space inside the bookcases. You get a sense of, uh, here of both the protectors of the village history and the researching folklorists. Books about legends. You can't read some of the pages. What could have been written here? Come on, let's get out of here. Mayu! No, it won't open. What do we do? There should be a key somewhere. I'll go look for it. Wait here, okay? No, don't go! Stay with me. Mayu. I'll be right back. You I'm... just promised! Don't leave me. Please. Don't leave me.
be right back. I really will. Wait just a minute, okay? Dear sister, are you leaving me again? Okay, well, dang it. That was also a really good camera shot. And hey, here's here's a map, I guess. I just found this. Uh, unless it's a new map. Okay. Mm, stuff, 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 stuff. I want to save. I want to reload my, my save at the, the temple to see if there was anything else in there. Because it's like I found the key and I immediately turned around. So I'm wondering if there was anything else in there. Um... A couple of notes. Um, again, the rumble feature in this game is so solid. Like, there's a, there's a. I don't know how much of it is just the way the rumble feature works in the PS2 controller. Like, it does have kind of a lingering rumble, so like they're just pulsing it for like a, a really low like heartbeat effect. It was like just enough during that cutscene to just. Oh, it really does just get you right in there. It's definitely the location of the key according to the map. Map says Osaka House. Key should be there. Hey, let's. Don't go. Stay with me. Tried calling, but there was no answer. Mia, don't forget your promise. I don't want to be alone. Yai, you broke your promise. Okay, okay. Oh, this is really slow scrolling. Yeah, there was an entire... Oh, what did I miss over there? What have I missed? What have I done? <laughs> uh, okay. Um... <laughs> That's it. it marked. Okay, there we go. Uh, map of the Osaka. Uh, there's the, the cross is there. Okay. Time for uh, a little bit of a treasure hunt, I guess. All right, little... Hmm, I'm trying to just memorize as much of this as I can. <sighs> Square stairs. Da, 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 da. Great. Great. Just mapping, mapping around. Everything's fine. Hmm. Were those stairs always there? Alright, well... Sorry, Mayu, but game design tells me I have to leave. Hey, we get some film this time.
I really feel like I'm I'm missing. What are the difference between files and memos? Okay, so memos are just like other things. So, taking a note from that, uh, they do pronounce the, they, they do hard pronounce Itsuki, not, not Itsuki like I've been saying. Where is this? Seriously, where is that? The Kurosawa house points to an exit. Where was this? Like, I didn't see anything that lined up with that in my map. Yeah, just nothing. Nothing looks at all similar here. I wonder if there's some amount of, like, rotation or any of that stuff that would add to the difficulty of reading this map. Alright, well, we'll just go this way then. It seemed like this was the way they were pointing me. Okay, that's a... Nope. Yes, I, I understand she's there. I would like to, the camera to move off of that. Thanks. Thanks, Ringu. Hello, Ringu ghost. Let's... Mm, yep. Yep, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. This is... This is entirely fine. You are... Much too close. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> I do not like this ghost. Not one bit. Nope, nope. Nice, nice big shot. All right, ghost, please return through the wall so I can shoot you again. One health left. Okay, perfect. Maybe. Are you done? Are we done? Are you done? Do you have freaking one health? <laughs> oh. Oh, I don't like that ghost. <laughs> Not one bit. Uh, 
I also really don't like the change in music. Oh, okay, we've got a save point down here. Great. Um, cool. So we're going to save real quick. Here's the plan. We're going to save. We're going to go back and load uh, our previous save to poke around the uh, rope temple just a little bit. See what's there. See what I missed. If it's nothing too important, then we're good. If it is something important, then I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, man. Um, great. Great, 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 great. Great. I could use a, a small break from ghosts anyhow. Oh, goodness. Oh, I do not like that ghost. That that ghost in particular, just the way it moves and like, it seems really tricky to, to pin down. Oh, buddy. <laughs> okay. So anyway, here's the shadow key that I had decided to leave behind that one time. What's in this temple? Ceremony Master's Note. Gaia is not coming back. Should she really leave Sai behind? Did she survive in the forest? If Sai is cleansed and acts as shrine maiden alone, the star might be appeased. The records do not mention any rituals with a single shrine maiden, but I will do it. I have to try. Yai, why did you run? Why won't you come back? Do, 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 do. Right, I need to remember that I can hold square to aim faster. Padlock engraved with a butterfly design. Great. Everyone's calling me. Okay, good news. We haven't really missed anything, and we are definitely coming back here. Cool. <laughs> nope, not a new game. All right, well, that was a nice little diversion. Let's get back into it and hopefully not have a horrible... Just hearing little whispering noises, it's fine. Everything's fine. Oh, uh, hey, it's the hammer key. Great. <laughs> oh, good, the flashlight turned back on. But we couldn't come on the house. Okay, so that's the side door. Am I back at the front of the house? Okay, well now I feel really bad about leaving Mayu in there alone. Oh, this is, is it a different house entirely? Is that what I have been doing wrong? These, yeah, this is a Kurosawa house. Not. Oh, that makes a lot more sense. Oh no. Oh no, I feel really bad about having to leave her behind. The Osaka house. I hear you loading over there, PS2. Just loading an area, or are you loading this ghost again? Oh no, I missed. <laughs> oh, that was a terrible, terrible miss. Oh no. Hey there, spooky. Spooky water ghost. Gotcha. Do do. This is fine. Do do. Sorry for the quick spins. Trying to figure out where this ghost is. Bring it. Bring it, ghost. Stop floating. 
Come on. Come on. I missed. Okay. Why... Why am I having trouble with this ghost? Because she keeps juking me. Respecting it goes for half a second. Uh, that was. Oh, uh, that that was. Mm, that looked like a graphical error, but it was also something I really did not like. It looked like me floating there for for half a second. this ghost combines like two really primary fears of mine <laughs> ghosts and water and video games I don't like it <laughs> perfect let's run towards the ghost she'll never expect that okay come on I just need I just need one more shot come on come on Come on, floaty ghost. Mm, those water noises are, in fact, terrible. And then she drowns. Everything's fine. Let's let's have a look. And what what can we what can we upgrade? We can upgrade sensitivity again. That's good. Display marker. Oh hey, we have like. that uh, C was a power of lens? Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, 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 cool. We still have 20,000 points. We can upgrade something else. I choose range. Alright, cool. 
Let's find the Osaka house. I think if I run into piddly town zombies. Oh, hey. I can, in fact, move the flashlight using the right stick. That's a nice touch. It's also really just good to know. Um... Okay, well, I think the Osaka house is the one that, uh, I ran into that one ghost that did end up killing me. I saw you up there. I see you up there. Bug out. Not good enough to count, but I saw you up there. Um... Okay, this music, honestly, it's really giving me Metroid Prime vibes. Like, it reminds me a lot of... Uh, I don't remember exactly which part of Metroid Prime, but it definitely has that feel about it. Yeah, it's this house. Okay, um... Lamp, it's book. Alright. I was going into my menu and I saw like the light moving. It was just my flashlight. It wasn't wasn't a ghost. <laughs> Everything's fine. Uh, map. Show me. No, this is not the right house. Dang it, okay. Actually, hey map, tell me what house am I am? The Kiru house. Alright, well this is not the Osaka house, so We'll see if this door has magically opened itself. Slash a ghost walk this way. Crystal barrel. That that was a terrible way to say crystal barrel. Osaka house. Hey, Matt, do you have any information? No. No, okay. Great. Great. Thanks, house. Yep. Mm. And there was a door over here, which is locked. Okay. Kiru house is, uh... Not the Osaka house. I don't know of any other houses I could go into in town. The rest were locked. This is the, the movie room, right? Curse you, heavy cloth. <laughs> Okay. 
Well, there goes most of my ideas. Kiro. Oh, the Zataka house was where we started. Okay. The button I want. It's never the button I want. It's our fault. We're running away. Storehouse bound. This is, in fact, the Osaka house. There. Oh, that's the room that had the body, isn't it? That's very much the room that had the body. You know what? Let's just take a quick detour to save. <laughs> getting to me again. It's it's gonna you just never know when a ghost is gonna show up and, and suddenly be a pain to deal with. And you're going back into the room that had like the body that was covered up with the mosquito net. And this is fine. This is fine. I probably Where is he? Did we get her? Come on. This heartbeat sound that you're hearing, by the way, the, uh, there we go. Uh, the, the rumble is in tune with that. I'm also wondering if I was looking at the, the wrong file the entire time, because there is a Kurosawa house map. That just shows the, the way out, though. There's a mark inside one of the walls. That is where... Faded stuff. Like, this is where we got the ginger key. Really wish you knew how long I've had this map. 
Uh, am I just wandering around entirely lost right now? Have I abandoned Mayu? And <laughs> how bad should I feel about that? I'm... I feel lost. I feel like I've made a terrible mistake. Nope. Not, not that button to put the camera back down. Never is. Alright, we're getting a lot of ghost stuff going on in here again, though. So maybe I am on the right track. Some flowers in the alcove. Pulling on the sliding door, but it's broken and won't budge. There seems to be a room beyond it. Type zero film. That sounds fancy. Special film, highest power, load slow. Okay, okay, that's... This room? Wait, no, this... I had the, the room wrong. It's this room, it's this wall. Still a really great off kilter angle. Camera equipment, uh, alarm. Hello, uh, fatal frame alarm. When the function is equipped, it uh, sounds a tone to warn you of the exact fatal frame moment. Great. It's interesting, there's so much that has suddenly appeared back here. So, like, I gotta be on the right track, right? Oh, it's gone real quiet again. <laughs> I hear you loading PS2. You got anything to say, PS2? Or are you just, uh... Just doing your work. It's 
right there. <laughs> Mortuary tablets, instance burners, family altar. Wait. It's right there. Mm, that's upsetting. room even is that? Is the next room over? Okay, yeah. Been there. Okay, we're getting to the point of Brace is frustrated at not being able to figure out exactly what needs to go down. And also was very concerned about going the wrong way, but this seems to be progress, but also, is it? Let's try going in here, see if there's like a way to fall down. Dishes in the cabinet. Hello, Peking child. You're not... You're not spooky, not one bit. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. It's just ghost. It's just ghost. <sighs> Spirit orb. Great. Cool. Like, I need more of those. Gotta have my spirit orbs. Speaking of which, uh, now that... I got far enough in, I have, I have seen the, the... Playframe, little quick dive into uh, into Fatal Frame Two, um, and it turns out I think I've missed a spirit, a spirit orb somewhere. I should probably go back and try to grab that, but it's like really out of the way. And eh, eh. okay, well, boxes are shut tight. Great, cool, found some items. It's like one part I'm a little spooked still. Yeah, I'm moderately spooked, honestly. Um but also it's quickly turning into frustration because this seems like the way I'm supposed to go. And there was even like a little spooky ghost happening in this room. But, like, I don't seem to be able to do anything about this. It's still not back. It's back in menus. It's not back. You feel wind coming in from a crack of the wall. Part of the wall looks like it would slide to one side, but it seems to be stuck. Great! How do I unstuck it? Did I just need to, like... Examine that, and now something is going to happen. Camera powers don't seem to be helpful. Just a drawer's ransacked. What could have happened here? Oh, 
this is where we get into it. Okay, so so aside from me bumping bumping things and uh, stuff, like we're getting into the, there's a lot of things that go hand in hand with horror, and it's always kind of weird. Like, one of the things that goes really well with horror is mystery. And so, you know, that's been a thing in games for a long time. But like, hey mate, I see you over there. Come on, bring it. Oh, and she's here too? Great, 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 great. Oh, cool. There is another one. <laughs> oh. Alright, well, in that case... Uh, that is entirely not the right buttons. Great. Hi. Please leave. Please leave. Please leave. Hey, are you still back there? Great. Nope. 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 <laughs> mm. I've got three whole piles of nope right here. Does anybody need uh, any nope? I've got plenty. Plenty to go around. Uh, please don't kill me. I would really like to get into a menu. Jeez, okay. This is... <laughs> this was fine when it was just one of them. <laughs> With two... Come on, pull up the camera. Uh, this becomes a lot... Uh, riskier. Okay, problem solved. She is so much creepier than the dude was. Oh, and she attacks so close to the fatal frame. That's rude. That's just rude. And there's still her out there staring. Just leaves you. Just leaves you. And she's still there. Great. Okay. Perfect. Fine. Everything's fine. Hey there, woman on deck. You, um... Thanks. Thanks for visiting. <sighs> God dang it. <laughs> uh, all right, that was that was a that was a pretty good encounter in the end. Uh, <laughs> uh having the woman on deck there as as a red herring the entire time like she she was what had me really spooked and that was just like a really Oh, uh, not a lot of room to move, and the 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 woman ghost there that that's a lot like that dude ghost we've been running into a couple times. She's spooky, like just she moves just slightly more oddly than than he does. And, oh, ugh, ugh, ugh. hey, can I open this yet? Can I witness a ghost event? 
Show us a sign. Come on. What do you want from me, game? Like, I really do not understand what I'm supposed to be doing because it's just like, oh, I can't move it. Okay. What do I have to do to be able to move it? Like, we don't have any obscure keys. There's no, like, oh, take a photo of it and it shows you somewhere else. None of that nonsense. It's just, oh, you can't, you can't do the thing. The key's marked to be behind here, but you can't. You cannot get ye flask. This is just the save room. Do I just have to keep like finding the the spooky woman and taking her photo until she stops spooking? Hello, spooky lady. Could you please show up and open the door that I need opening, please? And it sure still is a body shape. What am I supposed to do? Like... This is what I was talking about before I got ghosted. The, the whole... Like, you want things to be mysterious, you want things to be, like, unpredictable, but, like... As, as good as that can be for horror, it can be really rough in terms of gameplay experience, like what we're experiencing right now, where I'm quickly falling directly into pits of frustration, because it's like, they have shown me pretty clearly, it's like, you need to go here, and now that I'm there, they're just like, oh, but you can't get the thing, and there's no, there's nothing saying why I can't get the thing in particular, like, it's just like, oh, it's stuck. It's like, cool, how do I unstuck it? Who, like, do I need to go talk to, to the ghost, you know, the, the little trapped ghost lad dude? And just be like, oh, hey. Huh, I didn't notice this camera angle was uh, slightly tilted. Um, anyway. <sighs> like, what am I supposed to do? Like, go back to this house? Okay, like, that's already kind of a big ask. PS2 gonna load. Okay, great. Glad woman on balcony was here. To be there. <laughs> Glad that sliding door is still extremely busted. I've now been back through every room in this house again. Push comes to shove, you would make that move to get the key to get your sister. Just, just saying. I believe in you. You got this Metroid Prime using kicking back end. What? What the heck, man? I 
Okay, so this is where we run into like the whole emotions are weird thing. Like horror can go a couple ways. Like once you've been spooked. Like if you're having a good time of it and it's like yet great <laughs> triangle is back out of everything else but not not here butterfly diary for great great yeah why did you leave by yourself it's our fault this is happening to Itsuki uh, you promised we'd always be together, Sai. Great. Perfect. And fluorite. Okay, this door is still locked, right? That is a big old padlock. Seems locked. Perfect. Let's talk to Spooky Kid. Oh, anyway, it was rambling about emotions and stuff. Like, fear can... Like, you can either laugh it off or, like, if... if Things... Yeah, fine. I'll be there in a sec. Hey there, Crimson Butterfly. How you doing? Wee. Basically, like, you can you can either laugh it off and have a good time, or, like, if things aren't being fun anymore, then it can quickly turn into, like, anger and frustration and fear, you know, those sorts of things. And it's just like, oh, that's that's kind of what's getting mixed up here. It's just like, it, I was having a good time, and then it was just like the, the frustration of just like, oh, you cannot get E-Flask, and now I'm just frustrated. Uh, and, mm, mm, mm. Anyway, this guy. The cell key. I think they keep it at the Osaka house. Break the pinwheel seal to get to the basement of that house. Search the family altar. It has some kind of mechanism. Make all four sections of the pinwheel the same color. That'll open... Don't give up. We can get out. <laughs> Thanks, trap boy. Bye. <sighs> this is... <laughs> Grumbling about game design moment on this. So this one is purely like a... Nothing has changed. I don't have any new tools or skills or anything. The only thing that I arguably have is character knowledge. That board sticks out a little bit. That now Miu knows about what to search in that room in order to find the secret thing. <sighs> That's upsetting. That is really upsetting. Like, part of it is I'm frustrating with myself because, like, uh, yeah, the 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 ghosty maiden was kind of heading in that direction towards ghost trap boy. <sighs> But now, like, the only difference is I've talked to him, so now when I press this button... Oh, look, it's pinwheels. Uh, five pinwheel tablets, uh, in the small door behind the family altar, unlocking the device. Great. Um, oh, 
we get four turns? Oh no, oh no. Uh, okay. Oh, I hate this. <laughs> I should have paid more attention, but apparently I did it. Here there's something unlocking the wall next to the family altar. Great. I didn't fully understand that puzzle. I thought I did, but <sighs> Yeah, I, I don't like that. I I don't like that I just spent 20 minutes rumbling around trying to figure this out when it was just go talk to that guy but hey it's let's get back to spookingtons uh, stone mirror. What? I can't carry anymore. Revives you. Oh. Okay. Cool. Didn't realize I had one of those. Great. Perfect. Buddha statues, armor. Spooky things. Type 14 film. Uh, large space beyond the rocks. Must lead to some place too. Great. Film reel 7. Candlesticks and storage. Okay. All right. Is there. Nothing else here? I came here for a cell key. <laughs> um Oh, we are getting into right proper moon logic, I think. Yes, a large space that I can't go into because reasons. Ghosts, probably. Told to look for a key down here, though. Now, all we got was a film reel, so I guess we're gonna go watch a movie. And that might unlock a cell? Back to the Kiru house, where there was the film projector to project film reel 7, see what that's about, and then I, uh, I think we'll call it a day. <laughs> this has been... Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm really not happy with how like, the last 20 minutes have gone. <laughs> it has been really just... Mm. Oh, you didn't talk to Ghost Kid. You can't. You can't move forward. That, that sort of stuff like that. That's how you have a bad time. Hey, I, come on. <laughs> if you're gonna ghost around and be spooky, then 
you know what? Let me take me take your photo so I get points and junk. I'm also just upset that it's like, you know, I, I really, I, I want to, I don't want to leave my sister alone. So all this detour is just like, oh, this is sure is taking forever. Film reel one was the underground. Film reel seven is a door that opens. what that is supposed to signal like it's just like here's here's a sliding door that opens i guess we'll go all right let's head back to the osaka house i'm gonna check that one sliding door that's always stuck in the room with the body and if nothing happens either either way like we find a key or nothing happens we're done. We're saving in the Osaka house. Oh, I was so good and proper spooked, and that's just gone to frustration. And I'm really, I'm really annoyed about that because I know it's, it's, I'm not having as much fun, so it's probably not as much fun to watch. And it's just a, it's just a whole positive feedback loop of negativity. I don't like it. <laughs> anyway. Is this the door I saw? Nope. Great. Cool. All right, I'm gonna save. We're gonna we're gonna call it a day. I think I might try to find a walkthrough or get a friend to look at a walkthrough for me or something just to point me in the right direction because I have no idea where I'm supposed to go right now. And mm, mm, frustrating, just real frustrating. Like, look at this, four ten. 36 minutes that I have been running around this house. <sighs> That's frustrating. Okay. Cool. Alright, well, sorry for just really being bummed out for the second half of this episode. Like, I was, I was, I was in it, I was spooked, and then just moon logic has happened, and it's frustrating. So... <sighs> Yeah, let's call it a day. Thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate you sticking with it. Uh, I've been Brace. This has been VHS Play. Have yourself a lovely evening. <laughs>